have you been? Have you guys been here? Uh, we've been here for a, a year and four months now. So um, the first 16 months. First 16 months was definitely felt like the fourth quarter for us. Mm -hmm. um, fourth quarter meaning we had to get in the game before the, the game got over on us. Mm -hmm. uh, the area around here is definitely growing faster with building new stuff that will attract yeah. students. And we definitely have to keep our, our front foot forward mm -hmm. always because we're definitely not the fancy looking type of area, but we are the fancy talked about people to go to for situations, even if it's uh, asking questions, honestly. If people want to yeah. come here and ask me a question, what I think about that. And uh, they'll definitely uh, come back for more. One of the biggest things that attracted me was the college that was around here. Um, the downfall about it was that we were new in the area, mm -hmm. so we had to prove to the college that we've been here for many years already to continue that we deserve to be here next to you guys, and that we're just as interesting as anybody else around here coming from different places around this world. Is this something that you've always been serious about your hair, or you kind of learned I think I think I've been whatever about my hair personally. The thing that brought me closer to cutting hair was definitely my older brothers. Uh, they had a lot of friends that would be coming over to the house. And I looked at them like 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 regular friend coming over any type of day. But this friend would be getting a haircut by my brother, and that was the only difference of going over to your friend's house to hang out or whatever the situation was because all of that still happened. Yeah. But just in between they got a haircut and little by little I started realizing, okay, these guys are coming over here because not they have two stones for a bird. Mm -hmm. One they want to hang out, two they wanna let my brother know what's going on in their life or, or what fun activities are up for. Mm -hmm. Or what things stuck up for even a new client to, to bring around to say, hey, this, this guy right here can do it for you, he did it for me. Do you think here you guys get a good client relationship? Oh, you guys got uh, a lot of returning clients? Yes, we do. Uh, I definitely think that all of our farmers here have taken the time to get to know every single person that comes in here. And for every person that comes in here, they have nothing but good things to say on the outside when they go tell the teacher, they tell their neighbor, or the person that they first see in the morning to so notice their haircut. Mm -hmm. um, we've definitely been seeing a whole new trade and trending due to the fact that we're completing a lot of these tests that the students want even if they bring in a photo some type of visual magazine i want to look like the next uh, michael jackson okay yeah, you know yeah. what this is what we're gonna have to do for you mm -hmm. so you're there you guys are there to tailor it to what the customer wants exactly so you talk about starting a show yeah, man. I don't think, is that something you've thought about before? Uh, never that. Never that. Only because, I mean, anybody that knows the barber shop, man, a lot of crazy things happen at the barber shop. <laughs> and, I mean, crazy can, can come in a lot of different ways. Crazy, meaning crazy people, uh, meaning crazy haircuts, uh, crazy topics that we're talking about. But the experience here you have is like both mental, mental and physical. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. okay. One of the biggest things that is kind of kind of getting through people, but it's still a little tough, is letting them know that without telling them. Um, we want to just be able to share with them our space and mm -hmm. let them know that hey, this is you can come in. This is many times that I do. You don't need to come in here to get it. You need to come in here and hang out. You know, so it's just fun. But once people realize that this is that type of place that you can come to, we'll be getting a lot more people in here. To, to experiences. Not even to get the haircut, but just to watch his life. Because a lot of people like that. A lot of people are like, no man, you just, yeah, just started a show. And I'm like, yeah, but how we start a show? This person looks like this, and that person looks like that. And once we get everybody in the room knowing that this is how everything flows in here, this is the type of ice cream you get with the cherry on top, this is what it is. It's that one-stop shop. It's that one-stop shop. Excellent.